On a rocky desert plateau outside of Palm Desert, this residence is intimately nestled within a constellation of boulders, overlooking the Coachella Valley and the San Jacinto Mountain Range. A couple seeking a desert retreat, far from their urban lives, wanted it to be like this. A modest home that did not require the removal of a single pine tree that embraced the rustic desert climate and framed the ever-changing chameleon-like views from within. After the architects from Aidlin Darling Design camped on site to intimately observe and absorb the nuances of the microclimate, the vast diurnal temperature swings, the specific positioning of the existing trees and sculptural boulders, and to comprehend the power of the ever-changing light conditions on the surrounding mountains, the idea for the house began to emerge. The house would function as a simple framing device for the occupant to observe the dynamic surrounding terrain. The structure would be exceedingly quiet and crisp in its geometry, intentionally contrasting with the organic forms of the desert and very low to the ground to minimize its presence. Due to the area's dry and predictable climate, the house is composed of a series of separate wooden volumes clustered under a large, overhanging roof. The entry sequence from the garage to the house is articulated by the orientation and form of two concrete entry walls. They are intentionally juxtaposed to create a void between them, guiding the occupant to the glazed entry of the house. The parallel concrete walls not only frame the entry and the dining room beyond, but more importantly, the heroic view to the east and the Coachella Valley below. The square floating roof provides relief from the intense sun. The main entrance to the house is covered by the overhanging roof which is finished with a light wooden underside into an all-glass dining area that separates the kitchen from the living room. The large glass panels can open fully for cross-ventilation. A singular aperture is carved out of the roof plane, framing the dramatic sky above while providing the pool area below with ample sun exposure. The layout of the house is essentially three elements, a floating roof plane, a collection of wooden volumes and two concrete anchor walls. Below the roof plane reside rectangular wooden volumes that contain the main spaces of the house. Conceptually, they began as a singular rectangular mass that splits apart and extends into the landscape to maximize the experience of the surrounding terrain and create a critical open space in the center of the house. 
This space would become both the entry and the dining room, a place where public and private spaces meet, a place to break bread and capture both sunrise and sunset, as well as breezes rising up the hillside and through the house. The materials of the house were chosen to discreetly contrast with the lighter palette of the desert landscape. The blackened wood siding is acetylated pine wood that is burnt, wire brushed, stained, and sealed. All these treatments aim to provide a highly textured finish that is resistant to bugs and rot and minimizes movement in a climate known for its large diurnal temperature swings. The interior is a collage of concrete, wood, stone, and steel, each responding to its immediate application to maximize durability while providing the home with warmth and a soulful nesting quality.
This elevated vantage led to its name High Desert Retreat, which won a 2021 AIA Design Award in the Interiors category. At the back of the house, overlooking the site's steep slope, a swimming pool runs nearly the entire width of the house. This species of pine is native to the southwestern United States and can have a lifespan of up to 600 years.